Hey, groovy people. It's me, Zen Jen, with your number two in two days. Uh, <laughs> two in 25 days. <laughs> um, groovy fact, according to Zen Jen. That's me. So, number two. Um, when a child uh, with autism, perhaps nonverbal like Justin, has um, behavioral outbursts due to the fact that they have some escalation um, and the cause is unknown, they automatically go to a psychiatric hospital which treats psychiatric specific illness. Um, meaning, the second someone with a behavioral diagnosis, which we all know that not everything is geared towards or from a behavior, and sometimes it is your body is unable to regulate, um, so therefore behavior sounds intentional, you know, but uh, to me, sometimes neurological things um, can create behaviors. Uh, it's a very fine line between psychiatric and medical, yet a, psychiatr a psychiatrist is a medical, is, is a person with an MD, in a, and additionally, they have their psychiatry um, training. So, they are a doctor, they did go through med school, so I'm wondering why, when um, a child diagnosed on the spectrum gets ill, they're automatically sent to a psychiatric hospital and treated with psychiatric and behavioral models rather than exhausting the medical causes behind what could have caused the escalation or the change in behavior. Um, it's typically uh, treated with psychiatric uh, meds um, and sometimes there are underlying reasons uh, that are um, physiological, um, you know, diet, um, glucose sensitivity, uh, allergies, um, many, or you know, brain activity. Um, I believe that psychiatric and medical should not be separate and should be um, together and so should preventive, um, nutritional, etc. All of these things don't have to be separate in the world of autism where it you know, seems that there's several schools of thought and if, for instance a psychiatric doctor would go, well we don't do that here, we do this. And, okay, <laughs> but we, parents um, of kids on this uh, giant, wonderful adventure, want the best care um, for our child. And therefore, all measures should be exhausted before giving a child psychotropic meds. All measures. Um, including giving the family the kind of money and support that they would receive in a hospital prior to them needing a hospital visit. Prevention, engagement, validation, the concepts uh, that groovy people strive for for us all. That's to you. So do you understand what my number two was? Is basically all uh, measures should be exhausted prior to a psychiatric um, solution. Um, psychiatric should encompass, as being a medical doctor, all realms of health. Mm -hmm.